It's a little warm, no weather report, nothing's in the world, who's out there, what's going on, and why. You want to see this? You hear the sound? I can't hear you. I can't hear you, because you're not there. You're in the future. Maybe if you were quick, you're still a little bit in the future, and I'm in the future, and when is it? No, do you hear that sound? Whoa! Well, hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and here we go. I'm alive. I made it all the way back around here to Tuesday. I think I went pretty hard on the weeks last week. But, uh, you know, when it gets back around to Tuesday, it's almost a tradition. But, you know, repeat after me. If you, hey, tell me if you know this one. But Tuesday, we're feeling real. You're feeling real. Tuesday's the real day of the week. Uh, yeah. I was here yesterday on Monday, and I was uh, doing it. I was watching uh, TV. I was on TV. I actually went back and watched a movie yesterday. Sometimes I watch old episodes of the live stream from one at a time, but sometimes I do the program and then I go home and then I watch it and because I don't know what's happening, it's still something. And I don't know what I'm going to be saying next. I don't know where now what I'm going to be doing next unless I forget all my lines, but lots of things to be said and I'm saying them. I don't know what they're going to be and then I don't have time to remember them so then I can go back later on and watch it again, even like almost immediately and uh, I find my uh, self endlessly entertaining. Maybe that's why I'm doing this kind of thing. Uh huh. I've been thinking about doing, yeah, doing the other streamers things. I'm gonna get the uh, little camera um and play the games. You know, watch that live stream. Do 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 ding ding. Come down here anyway. What would be? Why would I be doing that? I might as well just move it out of here. And this room will be a museum. My home is a museum. I have rooms I don't see. I don't know where the rooms are, but they're museum rooms, and I never go into the museums. Uh-huh. It's Tuesday. Do you live in a museum? I was here yesterday. It was Monday. I was, uh, oh, I think I talked to my brother. I was looking at some tape stuff. I don't remember it all. Uh, I didn't even watch it back. I don't remember it all. I watched almost the whole thing, I think. Uh, I don't remember what was happening yesterday, but I was, let's see if we have any evidence. I think I was eating tacos. I was eating tacos, and looks like we did the numbers. Who's H, oh, ha happy hour's closing, maybe, happy hour. Talked to Freddy for a little bit. Happy hour's closing down. Freddy was on the bus. I was trying to figure out why Freddy had an infected hand. We'll find out again. We'll call him and say, hey, did you ever figure that one out? I didn't look. I didn't go and look at the episode. It was sometime around this time of year, and Freddie had a th sw swollen hand. I don't know. And now I'm saying infected when it was only swollen, and it could have been swollen for many reasons, but I still think it was caused, I mean, maybe it was caused by an infection. Whatever it is, I'm not over it. I'm thinking about 
Freddie's swollen hand, Freddie's medical problem from four years ago. So, uh huh. It was a big hand. It was a swollen hand. I'm gonna go. Maybe I should go rewind the tape. I think it was from 2019. I don't remember at all. But uh, that was the past. Now it's now. Time moves around. You know, it's mysterious. How does time work? Somebody stop me. I don't know how it, how it goes. I don't know why, how, uh, wow. Wow, did you do that? I got pizza. Wow. Uh, they, uh, I forgot what they call it. They got some kind of joke, because there's the Don Ho, and then this is like the fancy Don Ho, with, they call it Black Forest Ham, instead of just whatever Canadian bacon, but I don't remember the joke about it being fancy, but it's some kind of joke about the Don Ho, but fancy, fancy Don Ho. Is it the Donald Ho? Maybe I'm calling it Donald Ho. But I can't think of the Donald without thinking of Donald Duck. So, um, it's good though. Mmm. I like pizza. I like fruit on pizza. David Lieberhart really did not like the fruit on the pizza and he disliked it so much that he brought it up on, on his show. And was, I think, maybe th throw a little shade here. And pizza, pineapples for girls, he said. <laughs> pizza, and hey, maybe I just like the girls' pizza, David, okay? Or maybe you're not very forward thinking about pizza, about pizza rolls. I don't know, subscribe to your pizza rolls, David Lieberhart. I'm eating the pineapple on there. Um, it was good though, I like pizza. And I'm still eating it, and David Lebar didn't want to eat it. I got him a whole pizza on eating it. That was like weeks ago, though. Oh, hello! Somebody's coming in here. Pizza in a box. I'm eating this pizza. David Lebar said it, oh, it was a uh, girl's pizza. Uh, hello? We're getting a phone call. There's a lot of things. Hello? 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 Yeah. What's up, man? What's up? Who is it? My name is Red. Hi, Bra Brad. An R E D, like the color. Red? Yeah, like the color. What? Is that your name, or is that that's a co that's a color? That's not a name. It it is a color, and it's also a name. Hi, Red. What's up? What are you doing? Right now, I'm on my way home from work. Oh yeah, what's the road like? The road is bumpy, scary, frightening, and tragic all at once. What oh. kind of um, vehicle or like how are you getting there down this how road? Am I getting there? I'm driving my Hyundai Elantra. Hmm. How'd you find us? How'd I find you? Yeah. The real question is, how'd you find me? You called just you, now. You called me, yeah. Did I? I yes. don't know. I don't, you can convince me otherwise. Maybe I called you. I was trying to like reach out into the world. Did you get my? You got my mind signals read. Well, you you've been sending me some emails, uh, and uh, and then suddenly my phone started ringing, and I picked it up, and here we are. Uh huh. Yeah, the emails. You got all my emails. Did you? Are you gonna? I got. Are you gonna complete those, like things that I've been emailing you about? I mean, here's the thing, man. You're giving me some really serious tasks. Yeah. I don't know. Like, I don't know if I'm going to be able to complete all of them. I believe in you, and you can do it, and then well, it all work out. I couldn't do it without you. Wait, you you believe in me? I believe in you. I couldn't do it without you. Well, that makes one of us. What would I do without you? What'd you eat for breakfast? What I eat for breakfast? Well, did you see a dog? There's a dog walking down the street. There's a dog. Oh, I see it. There's yeah. two dogs. Cute. I think they might be friends. Oh. All the two dog day, right? All the two dogs day. Two dogs day. Two dog day. What's? 
Are you, are you gonna go home? I guess you're on the west coast because it's about five o'clock, huh? No, I'm on I'm the east coast. Oh yeah, you work late, huh? Yeah, I do work late. Uh, yeah. but I, let's get down to brass tacks, right? We're talking about breakfast, huh? Yeah, what'd you eat for breakfast? What did I eat for breakfast? I had a bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich. Mmm. Yeah, pretty tasty. Did you make it? I can't say I did. I was lazy. I went to Dunkin' Donuts. Dunkin' Donuts? Do they have those around here? They got them over here. Yeah, but do they have them here? Somebody's here. I don't know. Where, I don't think I've ever had where, Dunkin' Donuts. Really? Wait, uh, where, where, where do you live? On the West Coast. Where on the West Coast? We're in Washington. Oh, you're in Washington? Huh? I don't think they have oh. Dunkin' Donuts over there. Over like They got donuts and coffee, but not specifically that one. No, they, they, didn't yeah, they yeah. take the, the donuts off of it? Well, no, they still serve donuts, but, like, they serve a lot more now. Yeah, they call it just Dunkin'. You're not allowed Everybody to dunk them. your donuts over here. They, they rebranded. Yeah, yeah, they did. They rebranded, and I don't know if you're taking the rebranding very seriously by saying donuts on it, you know? Yeah. Let's You know, KFC rebranded, too. Remember when KFC rebranded? They used to be called Kentucky Fried Chicken. Yeah. And they're no longer that. Now they're, now, they're now they're KFC and it doesn't stand for anything. That's what I did here, but I'm still wow. sometimes telling people well, to that I rebranded but, to the letters. I mean, must have really taken a church mm-hmm. genius to come people, up with that People re-branding. always ask me what the letters mean, and then I say it doesn't mean anything, and then somebody else, they'll chime in, and they'll say it means this thing, and I, I, it doesn't anymore, I rebranded. Utah, and there was only one Dunkin' Donuts, but nobody went there. But on the East Coast, everybody goes to Dunkin' Donuts. Because they don't have Starbucks, right? No, we got Starbucks. Oh, you got both, huh? Yeah, we got both. We got choices. They, they got, it's mostly coffee, right? Yeah, it's mostly coffee. Yeah, we got 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 coffee. You know what I mean? Like that's what they're trying to do right now. You know? Yeah. Do they have a yeah. Do they have a donut sandwich? No, but they should. Donut sandwich. Yeah, donut like donut. it's like a bagel. You know, like a bagel sandwich. Yeah, yeah. But with the donut. But with the donut, I think that's genius. You know how's it? No. Oh. Well. Yeah. Maybe I should. Uh, Sell it to them. Yeah, I'll help you. Let's yeah, a I'm gonna get a um a board, a big board like that's like two and a half feet by three feet with paper on it. Yeah. And then I'm it's all all it says is donut. One word, first first uh first paper paper just says donut, and then I rip off the bottom half of the of the paper on the board, and then it says sandwich. And then no, I just sit saying. down and don't say anything. It's brilliant. Um, can you, and we'll do a free giveaway. Like, you know, if you buy a donut sandwich, uh, you get a free pair of sunglasses, courtesy of Duncan. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. I like that when they, when places don't have any specials and then you go there and it's always exactly the same, but I'm, I'm I guess we're already changing it up and donut, uh, Duncan probably has a lot of new things. Yeah, yeah. Have you tried the... Burger King chicken wrap? Nah, you know, like, I try not to eat too much fast food, you know? That's the thing. Like, I really only <laughs> What, you, what about Dunkin'? Only Dunkin' sometimes. You know what I mean? Like, today was a special morning. Yeah, yeah. It's hard to not eat breakfast there. Because well, the I'm orange, lazy. Like, it's or, the hate small it. one that's orange. It's got the orange lid, but yeah. it's small. Um, yeah. Have you... Oh! Have you ever been on TV? What? Have you ever been on TV? Yes, I have. Yeah, why? A few times. When? When I was really... When I, well, okay, so let me tell you. So, the first time was when I was really little. I went to Universal Studios in Florida, and I was on Flying Time Live. Um, and I almost got a pie in the face. On... So was, was it Double Dare? Or was called, the show was just called Slime Time Live? Slime Time Live. Do you remember it? 
I mean, I remember everybody getting slimed on like Double Dare and on Nickelodeon in general. Yeah, it, it's kind of similar to Double Dare, but it was like uh, it was like live, um, and uh, and the host came up to me and tried to pie me in the face, but then he pied the guy next to me. Was it Mark Summers? No, it was Dave Azer. Mm, I don't know who that is. Yeah. Um, so that was one time I was on TV. Um, another time I was on TV, I was interviewed by a local news channel because uh, I gave a woman CPR, and I saved her life. Did it work? Good job. Did you break her um, bones? I heard you're supposed to break people's bones. Mm-hmm. You, you can break their bones, but I I, I, uh, I didn't break her bones. What I want to what that happen. I want to hear all about this one. Can you start? Can you tell this whole mm-hmm. saving the life story? How many lives have you yeah, saved? Yeah, yeah. So what happened was uh, I was in tenth grade, and I had just gotten certified in CPR because it was a requirement for my school. <laughs> and you've been looking uh, around for it. What'd you say? Then you after that you got certified, and then you're like looking around for sick people. Yeah, no, no. I was just my dad was driving me in the car home from a dentist appointment. It was pouring down rain, and all of a sudden there was just a woman lying in the middle of the road, and a bunch of Girl Scouts and their mothers like running around screaming for help. Whoa. Uh, so we jump, we jump out of the car, and I go over to the woman, and she's like in full blown cardiac arrest, no pulse, she isn't breathing. Whoa. Um, so I just start doing CPR on her, and I did it for about like six or seven minutes until uh, the paramedics arrived and, and, and resuscitated her, um, and she survived. You didn't resuscitate her? Well, I was doing CPR, but they had to bring the uh, defibrillator, so the, the ambulance. And did, so did her. you really do anything? Yeah, I did CPR. But, but then she didn't wake up. I thought you were supposed to do CPR. And then they're like, <laughs> no, that's like, that's like a high-level maneuver. Like, if you do, what? if you do the CPR, you got to, like, like, you do CPR, but then you have to defibrillate them. Like, you got to shock their heart. So that's why you got to wait till the ambulance comes, and then they shock them. Oh, and, and they, the CPR and is just to keep them alive until they shock? Until you can, like, give them the paddles. You know what I mean? Mm. They, like, do the paddles, the electric paddles. Do you, okay. And then, the, and then they were okay. I heard that. After you have CPR and then you get brain damage, because you had, you had, like she wasn't breathing and didn't have, a, she wasn't breathing for a long time. Did she have know? brain damage? I don't know, but like it's a, it's a kind of a messed up story because like then she started stalking me. Oh you, uh, yeah, yeah, like like she kind of became obsessed with me uh, because I saved her life, and she like tried to like become a teacher at my school that I went to and it was kind of a weird thing did you um, did you talk to her at all yeah I did yeah I, when she recovered I did and I met her and like you know she gave me a real she gave me a nice watch like as a thank you gift um, but she like really like wanted to like I don't know she wanted to like talk with me a lot and everything and like I just didn't want I was like in 10th grade I didn't want anything to do with it you know um, and then she tried to be a teacher at my school, and I thought that was really weird, you know? Like, the school came to me, and they were like, hey, like, we know that this is the person whose life you saved, and she's trying to be a teacher here. Are you okay with that? And I was like, hell no. <laughs> mm. That's weird. <laughs> you know what happened to uh, her? I don't know. I mean, I know that she got diagnosed with, um, like, uh, muscular dystrophy later in life, and I think she's still alive, but I think she was just kind of like, you know, she, like she, that was the beginning of a lot of health problems for her. So mm. I, I'm not sure if she's doing so well now. You didn't want to be, you didn't want to be your friend? No, man. I was like, in, I was in 10th grade. I was like starting to get addicted to drugs and like I was depressed and I didn't want anything to do with her. You were addicted to drugs? So, yeah, yeah. I was addicted to drugs. What kind of drugs? Heroin and crack. At the same time? Yeah. Were you on it when you did the CPR? No, no, I was just doing, I was like, just doing kind of like pills and stuff back then. Weed. Crack pills? They have crack what? pills? Crack pills? Yeah, crack. Crack pills though? No, not crack pills. I was saying like, when I, in 10th grade, I was just doing pills. It oh, was like okay. in, uh, in like, later in life that I did. When, that about I when did you move on to crack? Uh, when I was, like, in my early 20s. I don't even know what crack looks like. Were you in 10th yeah, grade in your early 20s? 
What? Were you in 10th grade still at that point? No, 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 no. It's much later. What does crack look like? Crack? It looks like, um, uh, like if you take, like, it's like, they're like little white squares, you know, or they're like white or yellow, you know, mm -hmm. uh, and it's, yeah, like little, little, little squares. I know they call it rock, uh, but does it look like a rock? Like if you throw it? Kind like, of. Yeah, and, kind of. They kind of look like rocks. If there wasn't a gravel, a gravel area, area where's gravel at? Like oh. in the driveway? And then you think you would, yeah. would you think it was another, another rock? You, maybe. It, yeah, depending on the color. Is it hard? Like when you're, when you're high on crack, when you're high on crack, like you're, you're smoking it. And if you run out, you start like looking on the ground, like for like little things that look like crack. <laughs> Like there's more crack on the ground. <laughs> you're a smart man. Yeah, you smoke like a, like a not crack rock, just like a gravel. Looks like a yellow piece of gravel, you know. Yeah, and you're like, this is not working. It depends on the it depends on the quality of the gravel. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> wow. I wonder what yeah. happened. Yeah, what happened to that person? I want to help somebody, kinda. I bought a buy. I got a. Uh, I think it was yesterday. No, it was two days ago. I bought a guy a sandwich. You bought a sandwich. I bought a sandwich for a guy. He was outside. He was. What kind of sandwich? It was a like just like a pre-made deli sandwich, but I was going to the grocery. Uh -huh. I was going to the grocery store, uh -huh. and one of those guys, you know, they're outside the grocery store. I don't know if that, if it's like this on the east coast, but here, mm. there's always a guy outside yeah. the grocery store, with a sign. Yeah. And then he. I, I, this time I decided, I yelled at him when I was going to the store, I said, what do you want from the store? You know? And yeah, he, yeah, that's, he said, that's nice of you. He said, sandwich! Mm -hmm. you going to work at your high school now? I'm not worried, I'm hoping. I don't know where he is. I should have given him the, um, the number, the program number. And then, I'm like, uh... Oh, wait. But then, I've, then, if I did that, then I would be, um... It would be, wouldn't be as charitable. Yeah, so you could call in and thank you on television. I want that, to, I want that to happen, but I also wanted to, um, I did it for, uh, because I wanted to tell everybody about it here. And mm -hmm. then if you call, yeah. then it would be double, like too much. Right. So this is the right level, but maybe next time. Um, yeah, maybe next time. Yeah, be like, I'll give you, I should just do that all the time, but then. Did you also save that woman's life so you could tell people about it? You should just, like, make a t-shirt with the phone number on it and wear it around all the time. Well, I don't want... I don't want everybody to call only people I'm buying sandwiches for. Because then they own me. Yeah. Did, yeah. I should like being famous. Yeah. Did you... Did you tell people, like, what happened immediately after you saved that person? Did they... Did, did you... Uh, did like dad yeah, buy a, a donut and, and say you saved you saved that that person's life? I, uh, I I told I told the person who taught me it at my school um, like about the situation because I, I thought they would want it now, you know, because they taught me it. So they I told them in, and then my school found out, and they told like the news and the whole big deal. It was a whole big deal. Oh, you on the news? It's all because of the news. I forgot about the news now. Yeah, yeah, that's how we started. And then you were on the news, and then. Uh, and then the front page of the newspaper around here. And they said, CPR. What about the Girl Scouts? Don't the Girl Scouts... Yeah, the Girl Scouts screaming. Don't they know CPR, Girl Scouts? Shouldn't they? Wait, what'd you say? How come the Girl Scouts don't know CPR? I... <laughs> I don't know. Don't... Don't they... Don't they know? They're yeah, don't they know? They're just a run around screaming? I, um, was in Girl Scouts. They didn't really teach us shit. They taught us how to, like, weave stuff. And, uh, like, knit. Mm -hmm. They taught us how to hand knives to each other safely. You, you ever cut yourself with a knife? I mean, yes, but that's oh. unrelated. <laughs> well, um, but, but, like, uh, but not with the... Well, how about while passing... Not, not at Girl Scouts. How about while passing a knife? You ever cut somebody um, else? Um, well, yeah. Oh. Sad, <laughs> that's but how it didn't work out then. Pass it at off all. the pass. Red, do you think that the fame that you acquired as a young person from being a hero led to kind of a 
standards you had to uphold that led to crack and heroin? Yeah, it was part of it. It was part of it. Um, like, you know, that was definitely part of it. How did you, you get off the crack? Why? Uh, well, yeah, like sure, why? Was, yeah, why? <laughs> Why'd you get it off? Miserable. Huh? Why'd I get off? Because it was miserable. Yeah, it was a bad it time. Was right? I, I, I said how, but then uh, he said why, and then I, was, I guess that's also... Oh, how? Oh, yeah. How? Going to treatment. A lot uh, of times. I went to rehab. You sit in the, you uh, sit in the um, room with folding chairs? In a circle? What'd you say? Did you sit in the room with folding chairs in a circle? I'm sorry, I didn't hear that. You sit in a room, you get folding chairs. You know folding chairs? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're, talking, you, about, you're talking about, you're talking about, yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. That's, you you yeah, sit in a room, and then you put the folding chair yeah, yeah, back yeah. on the rack afterwards? And then what? You take the, the chairs. Did you have to carry your own chair? You put the chair therapy? back on the oh, rack. No. The other no, 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 no. Was, no? there. Did you tell the people at in the circle about the woman who you give CPR to? Um, yeah, sometimes. I mean, that's not, like, the most important thing about my story, but, like, you know, that sometimes that comes up. Mm. You know? Uh, um, but there, you know, there's bigger things, too, you know, like, but that was definitely a part of it, you know, that kind of led to a lot of problems. Oh, we're getting another call on the other line. Whoa. All right, I'm going to let you go. Okay? All right, call back any time. Okay, bye, Red. I will. Bye. Bye. Nice to talk to you. All right, take care. Wow. That was good. Thanks, Red. That was good. Hello? Multiple calls in a row. Whoa. Hello? Hello? I think this is Yellowfellow, but it's not working. Yellowfellow interrupted Red. Red was on a, uh, on a, he was going for it all. How much of that you think was real? I feel like it was all made up. Mm. No, I think it was his truth. Yeah? <laughs> Who knows? Yellowfellow, what's going on with you? What happened? I'm going to try to call him again. Or Yellow plus red. Yeah. Orange. Hello? 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 Yellow file is also in the treatment there. I should start asking people immediately, because it's like, who's calling the show? And it's like, hey, did you ever have a drug uh, addiction issue or... Um, um, a, a, uh, any psych, uh, what do you call it? Psychological breaks? Mm-hmm. Okay, I feel uh, like probably 100%. Oh, hello? Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, hi. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good, we were just talking to this guy who was, uh, he did, he said he did crack and then he had to go into the room in the, with the chairs in the circle and talked about his feelings. Because Whoa. he saved someone's life on crack right now. Grade. No, he was. He had done crack, and he got off of it successfully after doing the chair circle. Uh, doing like a recovery. He was in recovery. Uh, he was in recovery from crack. Yeah. And heroin. Oh yeah. That, we didn't get into that as much. It's not. I. I guess heroin is. Heroin's like, easy to beat. Yeah, but honestly, not, it's not as. Uh, uh, exciting, well, definitely. Then the crack there. Um, how are you? I'm well. How are you? What are you doing? I just got back to the house. Mhm. Mm from uh, the Bhutanese restaurant. Trying to get Bhutanese is Bhutanese, Bhutan, right? <laughs> yeah, Bhutanese. Yeah. Have you ever had Bhutanese food? I don't think so. I don't even know what it is. I guess it's almost Chinese food. No, I wasn't working there. Do they have orange chicken? Nope. Mm. <coughs> you have uh, a guest from the show today? Yeah. It's it, Amelia that's here. I was here before when you were, were talking. You are talking about Celsius. Oh, uh, like a couple days ago? Mm, or a week ago? Recently, yeah. Celsius. Celsius, the energy drink. Mm. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You still on those? Right. Um, yeah, but I'm slowing down a little bit on them. I'm mm -hmm. also not vaping currently. Well, I can't really say that. I vape today, but not as much. I'm leaning off the vaping because mm. it's starting to fuck with my body. Yeah. Yeah. It's really weird. Have you ever, have you tried, like, the gum? 
Um, I currently have nicotine pouches. Pouches. Like, like snus? Snus? No, um, no, it's not tobacco at all. It's just nicotine in a pouch. Do you um, just carry it around with you, or do you ingest it in some way? Uh, it's like a little uh, plastic tin of, like, uh, 20 pouches, and you put it in your upper left for, like, 20 minutes. That's not Eight what, milligrams. It's not what snus is? The nicotine. Snus is actual Pouches. tobacco? Uh, I don't know. If, I don't know if it is or not, but I don't like the stuff that has tobacco in it. Do they just have, like, straight-up nicotine pills? Um, probably. Oh, hold on. I have your record on the table. I just got back. Your, um, the, the, the thing. He gave you two. Yeah, yeah. You gotta check in. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, oh, I have to shake my phone to hear you. Did you wake up your your roommates? Wake them up? No, I'm sitting out front. He walked outside. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they don't have straight up nicotine pills? Uh, I don't know. Probably do. I have, I was using nicotine lozenges when I was in rehab. That seems like, like I, I mean, probably not good, but if they had, like, straight-up pills they could buy from a store, I might get those. You should start smoking. I don't want to smoke. I don't want to chew the gum. I told you I told you this before. That would be cool if you were smoking cigarettes. If I smoke on the program, yeah, I should probably at least only smoke on TV, and then... That would look so cool. And yeah. Then it might, um... I think it's, like, it happened with the kids, right? Smoking is not cool now. It's so cool. Yeah, smoking will mm-hmm. always be cool. Is this still cool? I thought that it went away, yeah. but like the um, I really don't like the vapes. I think I think I mean I actually think you should smoke cigarettes instead of the vapes, because it's like weird robot. I mean, it's like better than you're like 24. It's like smoking. It's like diet smoking, and it's like if you're gonna ingest the drugs, I think you should do it with pills. And not you're just gonna go straight to the pills, not try to get addicted or anything just I did, nicotine I mean, pills yeah, what yeah. would you hope to gain from that energy I, is that what nicotine it's, a, it's like a mild stimulant yeah like, like oh. a, not real not real energy no what is it what's it i think it's like the i think it's the illusion of energy so what's uh i mean what else is there coffee is the same thing it's not like you're getting energy or not it's it's all and it isn't energy like when you have it <coughs> an illusion what else is it what is energy like i'm not like not like spiritual energy or something but like when you have when you feel like you can do things like that's what energy I think, is right? i think it comes from getting enough sleep oh yeah but it can, i mean it doesn't matter where well. it comes from it's all no, it's all an illusion. It's not like it's a. You know. Not. I don't think so. No. I think there's true energy, and then there's uh, shortcuts that give you a fake version of it. Hmm. So only sleep and <laughs> sleep and exercise and instead of coffee. Get exercise. Um, sleep enough. Oh yeah. Uh, but yeah, if, eat well, exercise, and get enough sleep. What if you do all and, that uh, stuff and uh, cigarettes? What if you exercise and smoke cigarettes? <laughs> well, <laughs> or nicotine pills. I mean, people do it. Yeah. This I mean... A lot. I remember, like, I saw this guy on TV who was, um, ad- addicted to steroids. And he yeah. was... He was kind of, like, a weird, shrubby kind of guy in his attitude, <laughs> could tell. But then he was eating a lot of steroids and then doing a lot of exercises, and he was really weird. And he was also smoking cigarettes, though. They say it messes, that steroids mess with your testicles. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta look out. I mean, they mess with lots of stuff. Yeah, but I think they, like, shrink your testicles or something. They grow your muscles and shrink your testicles? Something like that. Also, I think there is a, a, uh, a, a smart way to take, like, uh, steroids or, like, extra testosterone or whatever, but most... People who do that don't do it the right way. I mean, yeah, right. you think 
I don't know if I would notice if my <laughs> testicles were shrinking. <laughs> like, oh, what? what? You in? I don't know. I don't know. You gotta check. Oh, yeah, I should check, yeah. like, uh, for cancer. Yeah, get, like, a little mirror. Mm hmm. Yeah. But I'm not on steroids. Yeah, well. Maybe you should start taking steroid pills. Mm -hmm. Well, I think that's how they, oh, they inject it usually, right? You should yeah. do, like, um, experiments on, like, your your being, like, who you are, like, change your ways and see. Like, socially? What, like, yeah, watch the developments week to week. Like, just try to adopt new mindsets, like, radically different mindsets. Yeah, and, uh. Pretty hard to do. I don't know about this. It's a vast and vague undertaking. I usually tell other people to do it when they're like, hey, you should do this on the show. And I'm like, well, maybe you do it. Tell me what it's like. What? But also, I'm curious about this proposal. What kind of changes? What kind um, of... I mean, you could, like, um, you could start next week, Kenny, you could start, like, really diving deep into the tarot. Um, and the tarot? Maybe the... Yeah, maybe the week after that, just like... You can start drawing um, cards on the show. Yeah, and then the week after that, just like, get really into like, uh, um, construction worker culture. Just mm -hmm. like, dress like a construction worker and hang out by construction throwing, sites. Throwing the hammers. Yelling at women. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Pack lunches that, like, you know, they sit really high up in those ledges and start the building. <laughs> what did what, what the cat callers even say? Like, what? What's the cat caller saying? They'll be like, damn, damn girl. Damn girl. Hey. You say, you say, hey, little lady. Hey, little lady, damn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you do the whoop, the whoop, the whoop thing, like the, um, I'm pretty the howl, that so. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, when you're, you're drunk, yeah. like the, you can't call people from out of the window right here. But then they know where you live. Or, I mean... They might not know where it's coming from. Yeah. From above. Shouldn't cat call people. It's disrespectful. No. Don't do it. <coughs> <coughs> um, I have to think of something for week three. Yep. Uh, um... Think. Let me think. Uh, start... Uh, I don't know. Maybe... Rave. Rave culture. Rave? Stuck on the rave. Like, and uh, everything that entails, like, goes along with that. Maybe get like, a strobe uh, in I here? Most raves happen on the weekends, anyway. Yeah, we could be a weekend raver. We could probably have some time. We're probably off work. Yeah, um, There's a lot of hippie raves around here. Mm hmm. Um, there you go. I guess I don't, oh, yeah, I don't want to, uh, to join a. It's not about thing. what you want. Um. What is it? I, I, like people like uh, I mean I, do, I have the program, other things. People like are like uh, living their whole life as like a genre, you know. Mhm. Mm and they're like, hey. Um. Well, we're doing it too. Am I? Well, you, everyone is. If oh. you're in a consistent life mm -hmm. pattern, week to week, where you do similar things, you're living a set. Like you're in a set mode. But I know? I like to think that I. Uh, Make my own, like, things. So. You forge your own path? You're an individual. I mean, what's my, yeah, I don't know. I mean, if I, I, I could be a, uh, yeah, like all these things, like you're saying, like I could be a raver or a metal guy or a goth, <laughs> uh, 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 like the, like a lunch table. You could be a lunch table one week. I think, I mean, yeah, yeah I guess I don't do much. I, even in my lunch table, I remember back in the days in my lunch table, it was the... Oh, um, I thought you said you could be a lunch yeah, table. Yeah, you used to be a lunch, be a lunch table. table. It was a lunch table. But when I had, like, lunch tables, it was... My, I would say my group was, like, the... the regu Like, the, <laughs> the standard middle group, which is, like, I guess everybody. I don't know what else there is. There's, like, jocks and um, uh, other things, but then there's... there's no, like, if you think you're standard, then you're, like, the freaks. I was the freaks? I that's think a, that's that's a, that's a, yeah, exactly. That's, our, that's also a type. The type who's like, oh, I don't think I'm a type. I'm just, I'm the, 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 what is it, the, mm, okay. the wallflower, you know? Wallflowers, yeah, I guess it wasn't the wallflower. I was friends with the girls who, like, planned prom mm. for some reason. Like, the, the mean girls? 
No, they were just like, oh, I'm going to help out as, like, an office assi- assistant. Like, do extra credit. Like, the, the tech... We didn't have a lot. Tech? N- no, uh-huh. just like... They were like, I'm going to put up, like, the boat, like planning committee. Yeah. I I always th- say that, that I'm going to um throw away everything I own and then go to Costco. Yeah. I'm going to throw away everything I own and go to Costco <coughs> and, you know, with, like... Start fresh. Start fresh, but, like, only Costco... And then, uh, I would be... That's my father. Um, I'm kind of starting fresh. I don't really have any of my things anymore. You, you threw um, away all your things when you moved out of Philly. You left your bike on the side of the road. <laughs> yeah, I was having a whole episode. Oh, yeah, I guess that was an episode. Yeah. I'm going to do it on purpose. You want to remember what I... I mean, wait, 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 that was a weird way to start that sentence. Do you want to hear about something I did during... 2020, like COVID, when it was just me and Luke in that apartment together. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> I forgot about this until recently when my friend was mentioning Cheerios. I uh, was cutting out a uh, honey nut Cheerio uh, vendor for a couple <coughs> a couple weeks, and I was cutting out the B from all the boxes, and I was hanging them up all over the kitchen, and I was drawing my own pictures of the B, and I was hanging it up everywhere. That's good. Yeah, that's cute. Our, 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 our kitchen was decorated with the bee from the Honey Nut Cheerios. I like that. I got Captain Crunch on my wall. It, it looks really, like, manic. And how many? crazy. Yeah, that sounds Whoa. really crazy. Hey, are you crazy? Do you know about the um, decor? How many, how many Honey Nut Cheerios were you eating? Uh, I was buying it consistently just for the routine. Were you eating you know, it all, though, or did you have more boxes than cereal? I was eating more than I usually would have if I wasn't trying to decorate my apartment Were with Were you that throwing piece. out Honey Nut Cheerios to get I to the I think beach? I was eating it. I I have decor- I have decorate my home with food packaging. Yeah. You should, uh, wait, how's uh, Andrew doing? Yeah, no, we should call him. Uh, it's, uh, we're going to call him? We could call him. We're just going to make it from John Webster. Phone? We got... We got two calls in a row, and we're kind of getting through things, so I think we should get some of this stuff. We got a message from John Webster, and we should call my brother, but we should listen to this John Webster message, actually, first. Should I hang up? Um, no, you can stay on the line if you want. It's up to you. Oh, yeah. All right, okay, here's John Webster. Hey, Kenny. Yes. Uh, this is John Webster speaking. Would you like to... Get- um, tomorrow, would you like to go to a baseball game? Yeah. Tomorrow night yeah. at 7? Oh, no. It will be too late. I'm busy, John. Uh, when you get this message. I wonder who it is. Uh, would you like to go to oh. the Mariners play Oakland tomorrow? In Seattle? Tomorrow night. Um, if you do, oh. give me a call. Oh, at, I, I at would phone number. That. That was like right now though. If you know, I, if I like leave right now, but I don't have enough time. Give me a call, please. I miss uh, you. I told John I need a couple of days ahead Thank of time. You. I think John's probably on his way right now. To the studio. No, John invited me to go to a baseball game in Seattle, I think. Oh, uh, damn. I would have done that. You didn't go to baseball like not too long ago? Well. I went to baseball. I went to baseball in Seattle. They got hot dogs there. Yeah, they do. They got you hot dogs I've and they been got hanging balls. out in, uh, Baltimore, Maryland, and it's weird to be in, like, the territory of, like, different sports teams. Different from what? Like, well, yeah, because you're in Philadelphia, they're crazy about it. Yeah, so now just to see people with, like, Orioles tattoos, it's very strange. They're somewhat crazy about it here. Maybe they're fair weathers. You yeah. Think? Well, I got to go inside and, and study my boots and these menu. All right. Call back well, anytime. Leave some more messages. Yeah, I'm, I'll try to get back on that. Goodbye. Who's Bye. Bye. Um, Kenny. Yes. Kenny. Okay. Bye. 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 Uh, John invited me to the baseball game. Uh, John, so nice of you. But it was um, he called it 12 a.m. last night, so he's going like right now. Mm. So I would, I could have gone, but yeah, it, too short of notice. Yeah, I would have gone, taking the camera. Hang Maybe out with John Webster. Means tomorrow. I wonder, I think it was, well, I mean, it was after 12, but I don't like that. I always say, if it's, like, the next day, people are like, oh, it's the next day, it's midnight, ah, you know? But I I don't count that as the next day, even mm. though it might mm-hmm. 
on paper or something, but that's just dumb. That's dumb. It's dumb to say that. It's the day. It's still Anyone the same. who says that is dumb. Yeah. I it's turned like, around my, my mind on it. Well, you, you were saying it? I was saying it all the time. Yeah, you gotta say it. You gotta not say that. It's the daytime. When you go to sleep, it's like one day, you go to the next day. Because I, I was doing sometimes, like, I used to work at a bar for, like, only le- probably less than a year. Mm-hmm. But then I was busy all day, and then I was working at nights, and then I was doing the program at, like, 3 a.m. And some people were like, hey, you're not doing the, the same day. You're missing your day. Right. But I would do it before I went to sleep. Uh-huh. And that's all, you know? Getting a lot of 3 a.m. calls. Uh, I mean, because we were on at 2 a.m., where we still are. So, yeah. Like drunk, yeah. drunks. Mm-hmm. Bye bye. Oh, bye, John. I'm not seeing you. Uh, he's watching the program. He called during the program. He's watching it on TV. I'm gonna, call, I'm gonna call you back. Well, I don't think he's gonna be able to answer though, unless he has a cell phone. I guess well, he might have a cell phone. But, um, I would go to a baseball game with John Webster. In the evening, and uh, yeah, this is Catherine. Hello, this is Kenny from the TV show. Is John Webster at that baseball game? No, he's not back yet. He has a, he had a, an appointment today. He's not back home yet. Did, did he go to the baseball game? No, he did not. Is that tomorrow? I have no idea. Oh, uh, he called. I can. He, he called me and invited me to a baseball game, which made it seem like it was going to be today. Um. I'm going to have to ask him when he gets home. So Maybe he was just asking me to watch it at back. his house. All right, well, um, tell him I called, okay, please? Okay. All right, thank you. I thank you very much. Yeah, bye. I said thank you, and then that person said also thank you. Mm-hmm. Why were they thanking me? I don't know. I guess it's you're welcome. That's the proper response, mm-hmm. thank you. Hey, Kenny. Uh, this is John Webster speaking. Would you like to um tomorrow? Would you like to go to a baseball game tomorrow night at seven? I know it will be too late uh, when you get this message. I, I mean, I guess he didn't ask if I wanted to go to the game. I mean, he asked. He said, "Would you like to go to a game?" He didn't say. The game that I'm going to. I'm going to a game, and I want you to go to the game as well. Mm-hmm. He's just talking about preferences. Um, could be. Like, hey, would you like uh, uh, World Peace? Would you like it? Mm-hmm. And he's like, oh, me too. And then that's it. He's like, why are you offering? Are you offering? Mmm. Mmm. Mm, that's a. Uh, uh, yesterday I was saying. People, you say, uh, hey, you should punch yourself in the face right now. Uh, well, I don't want to punch myself in the face. Why? Are you scared? Um, you scared of punching yourself in the face? Why don't you punch yourself in the face? You scared? You're some kind of scaredy cat and I want to punch yourself in the face? Yeah, that's smart. I bet you could get a lot of people to punch themselves in the face like that. Let's call my brother. Great. We'll tell him. I have so I much to say to him. I'll tell him to punch himself in the face. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Three, six, zip. Wow, that was a lot of calls. That was like, usually the calls, they only Mm -hmm. go for like, maybe five, ten minutes, and then I'm doing a lot of stuff, and then everybody shows up all at once. That's kind of how it feels like it happens. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, like some days I'm sitting here like, um, looking at tapes and being like, man, what's it all about? When it rains. Yeah. What is it all about? What is it all about? Now you don't even have time to wonder. Tune in. 
to me yesterday asking myself about what it's all about. So I'm gonna uh, cue the message of the future here, Great. and then we'll record a new one. Great. And um, say, hey, punch yourself in the face. No, why not? You scared? Very swollen hands. Bye, future. About a lot. Yeah. Um, I don't know why. <laughs> and then I said, uh, I told Freddie on the phone, I was trying to do the bit with Freddie. And I said, mm-hmm. hey, Freddie, why don't you go punch yourself in the face? And he said, uh, okay. <laughs> Did he do it? Um, he didn't do it, but he was, um, he was just yesing, yes ending on the program mm-hmm. kind of thing. And I said, you're supposed to say that you don't want to do it. And then I say, so he just, he's, I said, punch yourself in the face. He's like, okay. And then I didn't get the chance to say, um, to call him scared. I think I've punched myself in the face before. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. I was trying to give myself a black eye. Because I thought <laughs> it'd be cool. <laughs> I guess you could punch yourself in the face as hard as you can punch somebody else in the face. Cause I, like, maybe. It's harder to punch yourself. Because it, it hurts and you can flinch at the last minute. You know when it's coming. Mm. Have you, uh, uh, have you ever broken a board? A board? Mm, like a like a wooden board, yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, I've kicked holes in walls. <laughs> yeah. Is that? No, I don't know that I've broken a board. I want to break a board. Is there any boards? I bet you could. We got any boards? Got any boards? Some cardboard. Cardboard is harder to break with a a hand. Is that is that like the wood they get like um? Special wood. Yeah, cause they're breaking like ceramic, right? When they're like breaking like. It's like, maybe it's like not that difficult to break. Uh, I'm gonna get some board. It's probably really easy to break. Yeah. I mean, little kids are breaking it. Have you seen like, like actual children? Breaking wood, sure. They're always doing that. Yeah, they're always breaking wood, these guys. Uh, Yeah, I guess it's like a secret. Just other people think it's cool, but then you find out they're just breaking, you know. It's, know, it's soft, not even it's not even hard not hardwood I'm gonna <laughs> it's not 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 the best people to um, challenge uh, people who are breaking boards because they're already they already have a tendency towards violence but I don't think you're doing anything uh-huh especially towards boards I don't think you can break nothing it's a bunch of weak board breaking you know just a magic trick mm-hmm Oh, you think you can break that board? Well, try breaking my face. Yeah, I get ya. Uh, I'm challenging you physically. Uh, all you board breaking wusses. Um, are you ready for the message of the future? I already queued it up, I think. Okay. Uh, hey! hey! Future! future. It's us the past. It's us the past. You've punched yourself in the face yet? How's that healing? Split yourself in half? How many logs, I mean, pieces of wood you broke today? Uh, we talked to Red about uh, CPR and crack and yellow fellows studying the Bhutanese menu. Still talking about getting punched from yesterday. Uh, it's Tuesday. Bye, future. Woo. Uh, okay. That was... Um, that was this year, really, last year, 2019. Did you look at Germany from the 90s? Were you around for that? I saw a little bit of Germany from the 90s. The the Germany from the 90s family, or I'll show you. They made a home, and then they are playing baseball now. Great. I love to see them thriving. Well, this is the lawyer. Have you seen the lawyer tape? Yeah, that's not fun no. to watch. It is a really boring. I'm trying to get through it. Really bad. I guess you got to get through it. Or how long? Do we know how long? So it can be deemed Have you been taking it in? Do you know what she's saying? <laughs> no, the audio is really poor as well. I hate this. Oh, Q and A. She's got a little <laughs> question. I'm not entertained by this. This is from 1993, well, though. you made it a little further through. Yeah, we're going to get through the whole... I mean, I watched all of that okay. already. But, yeah, it's still about halfway. Um, it was 2019, and then I'm looking for the, uh, the, 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 
mm, last year. He's around here somewhere. Or about uh, he worked at the airport at the store and uh, about Knott's Berry Farm. And Freddy's on Vashon Island. Mm, and he's from Freddy. Chinese food. We only got about five minutes left. It's a good time. Yeah, Thank the, you. The last year. Um, hey, future, it's just the past. Hey, Mark, tell them about the pizza. If you eat a pizza, then you'll turn into a pizza. Oh, no. Right. Oh, I a whole lot. I'm not a pizza yet. Hey, future. Freddy was on an island. I was on an island. Mark's never been on a boat. Very nice time. Just take my pizza Thursdays. Thanks, future. Bye. Mm. Still like pizza Thursdays? I think they're still doing eggplant pizza Thursdays, even all these years later. There's a uh, 2022. Great. Maybe. Maybe. Where is it? Uh, hey, are you still alive? Hello, uh, Don't drink and drive. Good idea. Where is Tunisia? Asia? Um, hopefully you found Tunisia. I ate too much couscous. And uh, hopefully in the future, do better glaze. Do better glaze, people. Bye, future. Do better glaze? Be at Carl's Jr. I don't know what Heather was saying. Do better grace? What, was, what did Heather just say? I could not tell you. Do better grades. Do better grades. I don't think Heather was in A school. A pluses. Heather's not in school. You can be graded on anything. Oh, yeah. 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 We got a batting helmet on we'll get you yeah. I think this is Lacey yeah. in the 90s. Yeah. Yeah. They get in they here. still might be yeah. Germany because there's army guys yeah. around. Yeah. This is really private. This is like bedroom. Honey? What are you doing? I don't see what's Well, bedroom. Oh, isn't that bedroom video. <laughs> What are you trying to break? They have the um the fade out effect, so then it's um I'm gonna get this book with the numbers. I'm gonna call Friday. We'll call Friday. We'll do the numbers. We only have about five minutes left. Great. Everybody, like some days, yeah. Some days it's like trying to get through it, and then other times I'm rushing. You're in September. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, what the heck? Uh, I skipped a... What the heck? That's odd. <laughs> How'd that happen? Uh oh. Hey, program. Hey, Freddy, how are you? Hey, Freddy. I'm here, too. I'm alright. Hi. Um, I'm in the drive through at Jack in the Box. Uh, what are you going to get? I got two tacos that... I haven't got the pay yet, um, but I, they gave me my tacos, and then I almost could have driven off without paying, but then I handed my card, and now mm. my card's on the other side of the glass, and they're like working on some computer problem or something. Yeah. So I got my taco. I'm eating it right now. They're not supposed to, um, they're not supposed to do that. You like Jack in the Box? Uh, one day I got it because it was like the only thing open. And then I got the tacos, and I really want to like the tacos. I hear from somebody else. Let's uh, see. We only have about three minutes left. You want some numbers? Yeah, what you got? Yeah, 12, please. Oh, I got to call TCTV as well. I forgot. I was supposed to. What's their number? No. Uh, 360-956-3100. Are they open? Yeah. Paula just texted me. I got to I gotta call them to RSVP to the barbecue. I think my card is there, Okay, you're gonna I'm gonna call them. Freddy, thank you. Bye bye. bye. Okay, we don't. Okay, he only had 12. Freddy? Okay, I think I just drove off without paying. 
Yeah, they gave me four shotguns and stuff. Good, good. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna call DCTV as well. I think here. Okay. Are you gonna try to call them at the same time? If you can give yeah. me three more numbers real quick, though. Okay. How about nine five? No, no, can't wait over ninety, huh? Nine five six three. Thirty one. Thirty one hundred though. Yeah, nine five six thirty one hundred. How about? Oh. Six and thirty one. Wait, same line. Sorry, I think it's calling both of them. What? It's calling the other. It's calling both. It's calling the other one. What? What one? I think it's ringing with them or something. It's not showing it. Hello. 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 TCTV. Hello. Hello. Is this, Hello. Is this TCTV? No. It's not. I said no, Mac. Who is this? Hello? They might be gone. Who are you? Are they hung up? Oh, well, well, the show's over. Right you don't want to say, like, hi. Uh, who are you? I They're like, uh, <laughs> you called me. I forgot to call TCTV, and now the show's over, and we're out of time, and I, but I'll just, well, I was going to, I was going to RSVP. RSVP, do we have to? Yeah, we don't have to, but I saw somebody that said that you could, and so I was oh, yeah. going to, but then I forgot about it because it was very busy. But now the show's over, and we didn't even do the numbers, which is okay. We, only you got some numbers I got today. some in. Oh, you did? Should we do them? And Freddie got two numbers. All right, well, that's it. Yeah. That's what the numbers and are. Yeah. four tacos. All right, the show's over. Okay, okay. here's the credits. I don't, I don't think I had to pay. I think they didn't charge my card. Congratulations. Yeah. Wow, that's weird. Better, it's the best food. Free food. Thanks for watching. It's Tuesday. We're on TCTV, Charles, wait, check it out. I got a message from GTTV and they wanted me to do the bingo game. They're like, can you run the bingo? And I was like, no, I can't. Oh, yeah, I'll run it. Why would they offer you to run it? Yeah, they offered me to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how to run it. Why would they offer me to run it? Because I don't know how Thank you, and viewers, that you are watching. Thank you. Hey, John. Are you going to baseball? Hell yeah, dog. Hell yeah. Bye. Bye-bye.